Mainly because, like, compared to when I was, like, 21 or 22. Chase, why are you laughing? <laughs> Chase, why are you laughing? Did you read the word? Well, Nothing. Sorry, he's laughing. Please I'm, continue. He's please laughing continue. at the chat. <laughs> Chase, 21, please, 22. Please continue. Yeah. How dare you, Chase? Please continue, as you were saying. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are good. Guys, today we're going to be reacting to Gorok the Destroyer. Can't stop making them laugh, guys. I don't know if you guys have seen clips of this Gorok girl, but let's go right down to this. While you pull that up, I just want to add one thing, Deborah. I think modest women, it's so attractive. Rip. Can just push that back? What was that? Can you just push that back? I think it makes uh, you feel more like a woman. It's so it's I feel so the same. Attractive. When I'm in a modest, like, long dress, I'm like, wow, I feel like I'm on top of the world. Yes. But that's something that I think came with age. When I was younger, I felt cooler in a crop top, and then Wait, I Eric, reached Wait, Eric, were they more point. gifted? No. Okay. I want to add on to that, like, like, something you say that comes with age. Like, as I'm getting older, because I'm still 23, I feel like I'm, I'm about to turn 24. But I feel like in the last year or so, like, my style is, like, ever so changing when it comes to confidence. Mainly because, like, compared to when I was, like, 21 or 22. Chase, why are you laughing? <laughs> Chase, like, why are you this laughing? Is good. This is not nice. This is not nice. Nothing. Sorry, he's laughing. Please I'm, continue. He's please laughing continue. at the chat. <laughs> Fucking Chase, 21, please, 22. please continue. Yeah. How dare you, Chase? Please continue, as you were saying. Cool. Um, no, just, like, basically saying that, like, Compared, compared to when I was younger, like, let's say I'm wearing, like, a little black slip dress and, you know, like, a little wedge to the club with a YSL bag. That would make me feel pretty. But, like, as I'm getting older, it's, like, almost, like, when I cover up, it's, like, you feel more beautiful. But that, I guess that's something that comes with age. And, like, I feel like a lot of younger girls. Yeah, like, in high school, you're just going to want to wear what every other girl yeah, wears. Exactly. Like, a yeah. crop top and, like, some booty shorts or whatever. Yeah. Can but I specifically ask this to you? We totally don't have to speak about it if you're uncomfortable. But what age did you start identifying as a woman? Can I be honest? I have always known. Like, I never knew the word for it, if I'm being honest. Like, growing up, I didn't know what trans was. I didn't know it was a thing. So, like, anything that grasped onto femininity, that was me. You know, like, anything, I put a towel over Wait my head. Wait a minute. I would, literally, my mom and my parents, like, when they would have their night out, they would babysitter to come over. I'd steal my mom's heels. Like, femininity for me is something that's always been 100% natural and not forced. So, I believe, I think it was, like, um, like 14, 15, um, was when I discovered what trans was, mm. you know, and I was like, oh my god, like, wait, it's, I'm not a drag queen, because at first I thought I was a drag queen, because, because I didn't know what trans was, I didn't know that there was a name for it, I just knew that I was more than that, and then, I guess, like I said, as I got older, then I started experiencing with makeup, I let my hair grow out, and I fully started living as a woman when I was at the age of, like, 18, 19, I want to say. I started letting my hair grow out, I started experimenting more of my clothing, oh, etc. Sorry. Um, is your friend good? It sounds like you're saying a lot of jokes there. <laughs> I don't know. The chat was saying some ridiculous shit, so they were. I think. Uh, okay. Probably um, getting dragged. I just want everybody to know. I drink. Okay. There's sometimes you have maturity to be able to read something and keep it in. Uh, no. I don't know whose that was. I almost okay. vomited. Uh, AED 750. Looking, looking at Kiko. Looking at, do you want to read this one, Kiko? Yeah. Looking at Kiko and the way she behaves slash reacts and appears she's an actual six downgraded to a five masculinity a woman is a man repellent i can guess what her bf is like now honestly you guys would have no idea what my boyfriend is like you wouldn't have the slightest you're a really good like reader thank you i like the emotion <laughs> the <laughs> here for it. thank you mm -hmm. so that's a good reader well guys um okay okay let me get the cheap is he, she, a trans? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But I just couldn't stop laughing. And I don't know why Chase was laughing so much. So much. Like, nah, nah, that wasn't nice. That wasn't nice. But guys, this is funny. If you think that's a joke, sorry for you. But this is funny as hell. But I, I don't think I even have much to say. Because, um, I think like, I literally watched it. So it's more like the joke was in in the video, but let's be for real. Let's be for real. I'm going to talk some serious shit right now. Um, 
speaking about, no, I, I'm talking to, to I, I'm not talking for trans, I'm just talking to people in general. Please be confident of yourself. Whatever you want to wear, please wear it. Put it on. But something I'm going to say, where you want to dress, no, please, don't, don't drag me, don't drag me, because I swear to God, I am not talking about this because of God, I am not, but for real, even to me, guys, when you want to dress, like you see, I'm not smiling anymore, when you want to dress, please dress according to your body size, mm, it's really important, like, it's fine, you want to wear a crop top, and you know, you want to look sexy as hell, but, mm, just um, find a perfect size that suits your body. That's just it. I'm, I'm being for you right now. And I'm not talking about this because of God, look, I swear. But just find something to put on that fits your body. So when you come out, you're not being laughed at or mocked or like a lot of people stare because people know how to look. In fact, people should start looking at people for a living. It will really pay me, like literally. But please, like, just dress up into your body size. It's really important. That way, you, you feel more comfortable about what you're wearing. You feel more confident in yourself. Because you wear something that doesn't suit you and you go out, people are staring at you. So people are talking to themselves and then you just feel this person is talking about what I'm wearing. You feeling like that, you're not comfortable in what you're wearing. Maybe you wear before you left your house and that's because you felt it looked cute. But you coming out, you realize that you're not comfortable in what you're wearing. Please, you think before you come out of your house, look at your dressing real very well. So that that way, you, you know that what you're putting on is it's nice and you can go out even if people are talking you don't give a shit if it's about you so please first thing first find something that fits your body size look confident in what you're wearing and i think you're good to go so guys tell me what you think about this and please don't know, drag me don't come for me i didn't say this because of god i just said what i said have a nice day guys